Oh, what a mess. Look at my tolls. They're just laying all over the place. Pretty much the first time I've been down here since that big snowstorm. Well, let's see if the old mower will start up. I doubt it. Man, what a dump. It could look really nice in here if I could spend some time down here, but... Where do you find the time, right? All right. Let's get some of this stuff cleaned up. Well, it's not great, but it's definitely an improvement. So at least we can get the mower out of here now. I guess I should have checked and seen if this thing would start before I started cleaning up. That way I could have put the battery charger on it. Let's see if we get lucky. Of course not. Okay, well, I don't have any power down here anymore, so this is a problem. So, either gonna have to push the lawnmower up the driveway, or find enough extension cord to reach all the way down here, or take the battery out, and then take it up to the house, and then put, put it on the charger up there. So I decided the best course of action is gonna be to take the battery out. So, that's what we're gonna do. Have to let it charge a little bit. I mean, this thing's completely dead. You didn't even hear a tick when I tried to turn it over. All right, guys, so just forget about the ride mower. We're gonna try this the old fashioned way. Right here, I got a lawnmower <laughs> or a weed whacker. Let's see how it works. Oh yeah, look at that. We don't need that mower. If we do this for about six months, we should be able to get it cut. This thing does work pretty good though. So it's currently the next day now. I let this charge overnight on a two amp trickle just to, I mean, there was no juice left in this thing at all. So I'm really hoping this battery is still good. I don't want to have to buy another battery. This lawnmower is only like two years old. And of course this is the factory battery. So I'm going to throw this back in real quick. I'm not going to record it and uh, see if it starts up. So I got the battery back in. It must be holding the charge because one of the headlights are on and one of them's blown out. So hopefully we don't get pulled over. I'm gonna cut the grass anyway. I live on the edge, obviously. Risk taker. This is how it was when I got this mower. That should have been assigned to not buy this mower. But in all seriousness, this mower is awesome. I love it.
we have here? What are you? Oh my God. What are you? Huh? Are you a groundhog? Or a mouse? Huh? Oh, what are you? Come here. What is it? You've been getting in my way. Where'd you go? I think we're just gonna stop there with the grass because the wind's blowing like 30 miles an hour and every time I make a pass it blows back right into my face and I keep getting grass in my eye and I had a horrible experience this year with getting something in my eye so I definitely don't want that to happen again so uh, I think we're just gonna go make some food instead all right let's get out of here Hey, what's good guys? Welcome back to the shed. Today, we continue the grass mowing. This literally is, this is, this literally is my entire life. It's all I do is cut grass. I cut grass, I shovel snow, that's it. I, every now and again, I get a little bit of a break, but man, I need to find a better gig. I, I don't even pay myself very well. The first day I had to go get gas. I went to start the mower up, the battery was dead. So I had to let the battery charge. So we charged up the battery, we put it back in. The next day we attempted, we did mow a little bit of grass, but my God, there's so much more. And that's the, the ride mower part's the easy part. I mean, it, it's the push mowing and the weed whacking, the banks. I mean, it, it takes days. I mean, it literally takes me days to get all the grass cut. And then by the time it's done, I have to cut it again. So I have a lot of projects that I have to work on. So uh, I think I might start posting some videos here and there. It just depends if you guys like them or not. This video is not going to be that great. I mean, it's just me mowing grass, but um, yeah, so let's do it. All right, time for the forecast. It's a great day. I mean, it's sunny. It's beautiful. It's Saturday. Can't complain. It's a little chilly. out. It's not chilly. It's nice out. It's, it's right on the line of being chilly and warm. Like if it was five degrees colder, I'd probably have a sweatshirt on. I think this might be another project we do on the channel. This is my old car and it's been sitting there for a couple of years. It's a nice car and over the winter time i'm pretty sure that the mice chewed the wires off under the hood so that's definitely an issue that we'll have to figure out eventually i don't have any power down here anymore so uh, it's really hard to get anything done but we should be able to fix it without power we'll look at that another day
Well, I think that's enough for me today. I'm fat, man. I, this is a lot of exercise for me, man. First time cutting the grass. Cutting the grass isn't so bad, but man, the wind was just blowing just enough to blow grass back in my face the entire time I was cutting it. So I'm covered in grass, grinded up bugs. Who knows? I'm gonna go take a shower, but uh, thanks for chilling.